Welcome to the Game Audio Resource Wise and Unreal Audio Implementation Guide Series. In this guide, we quickly look at how to give Wise access to essential project source control platforms like Perforce. Using source control allows the user to timestamp check ins of content, giving a point in time the Wise or the Unreal project can be reverted back to if needed. For those of you that are working remotely or with an internal team, you will no doubt be using a central project manager of global game content updates submitted by every team member daily. Most common in a professional environment is Perforce Helix P4V. WISE has a feature that allows WISE to communicate directly with Perforce. Helix Core is available for free for teams up to five people. If you wish to investigate it further and try yourself source control management via Perforce, please see the link in the description. First we install Perforce. Then we set up connection details of Perforce in WISE. You will need to install the correct Perforce software. Normally in larger game development teams, Helix Visual Client P4V will be used. Once the version of Perforce is installed, the team you are working with will give you details and address IDs to connect Perforce to. This enables you to connect to the same project server data that the entire team are working with, also allowing you to have access to the project data so you can download the project content. Once Perforce is set up and working, open WISE. In the WISE toolbar, navigate to Project, Project Settings, Generals tab, and then Workgroup. Under the Plugin, in the drop down menu, change to the Perforce option. Then click on the Config UI button. In the new window, input the Connect to Server Details ID addresses the team you have worked with have passed you. Then click OK to confirm the details. So what exactly does Source Control do? Every time you save in Wise or Unreal, the associated content you have modified will be checked out in Perforce into a submission list. The submission list can then be submitted to a central server. Note, new files are not automatically added. These will need to be marked manually as add to be shown in the Perforce submission list. However, a big note for freelance and remote workers, if you are remote working to a central server, it is advisable not to enable this setting. Connection signs to a central server when saving wires can take a while to process. In other words, it can hugely slow down your workflow speed. If you're working internally or at the same location as a server, then the process speed is extremely quick and absolutely recommended to be enabled. For further notes of what to check in or to submit via Perforce, please see our associated written guide of this chapter for further details on our website.